Hey what's up guys, this is 6 tips and tricks for OS X Mavericks. First is uh, you can now change your picture. Before Apple only allowed like a certain few pictures, you could choose maybe like a guitar or uh, some other weird picture, but now you can actually choose whatever picture you want. Uh, so I did that immediately. Um, there's some options you can choose from like iCloud um, and other uh, social medias but I also found out you could just simply find whatever picture you wanted uh, even out of iPhoto and just drag and drop that picture um, you can easily adjust it and crop it uh, and then your picture will be set as your username second is tags Mavericks allows you to tag stuff um, we've been using tags forever for like YouTube Twitter um, searching the web for information now you can save your files with these tags uh, they provide like some colors and some um, like for instance I could use orange is every picture is going to be assigned orange and then you can describe it like goat J 2013 um, zoo or if it's for a certain project and then when you go into finder which is now full screen you can go ahead and type in those keywords just like you're going to search for something um, through Google next is the notification center now I don't use the notification center for a lot because I always have my iPhone on hand so I like to receive my messages and things like that through there but there are some times when people do use notifications a lot and they have actually added a do not disturb just like the iPhone so this will prevent any messages or notifications popping up and disturbing you so I'm just gonna go ahead and leave mine on and now on to voice dictation previously we were only allowed to use voice dictation when we had Wi-Fi um, but now Apple has made it so you can use voice dictation without Wi-Fi so anywhere on your Mac now that you uh, want to use voice dictation you just simply hit the FN button twice voice dictation works now without internet connection and it will convert speech to text and there you go and number five, this may not be a big deal for a lot of people, but I think it's awesome. Now, when you push the power button just for a second, your screen will turn off. Uh, your computer will still be on, but the screen and display will be off. This could be handy for maybe if you're uploading and or downloading some files and you don't want to put it to sleep, but you want to keep the computer off, turn the display off. Um, also, if maybe you're going to watch a video um, on your Apple TV, you can go ahead and just turn the display off and that will save on battery and just also save on uh, your display um, how much you use that and last but not least now they have made um, using dual monitors a lot easier you get a display bar and its own separate screen um, so I've been able to use it also with my Apple TV this would be great for presentations or if you wanted to work on the computer maybe you're watching a video or listening to music um, so that's that Mavericks is pretty cool um, I've been having fun using it, so uh, if you haven't updated yet, go ahead and do that. It's free. I haven't experienced any problems, and I uh, hope these tips and tricks help. Thanks for watching.